This episode of Scientific Tuesdays is brought to you by Audible.com. Get a free audiobook at audiblepodcast.com slash Tuesdays. We're on location this week to show you how to properly celebrate New Year's, the way nature intended, with a high-powered potato cannon. So today we're going to build a pneumatic launcher, or an air pressure launcher. This is basically just a bunch of PVC pipes all put together with a valve, and then, you know, we, we pump some air into it, we get the pressure high, and then we let go of the valve and something fires out of the tube. It's that simple. Now to start, take one of the PVC pipes you've got. I'm using one and a half inch here. I'm going to put some rubber cement around it, or PVC cement if you want to get technical. Once I've got that, I'm going to place it into one end of the valve and hold it in place for 30 seconds. Now it's important that you hold it down hard because you want it to set in place before it dries. Once you're done, put that aside for now. We're going to take our end cap and a Schrader valve. Schrader valves are great because they're not going to require you to glue or form a, a big seal of glue inside the end cap itself. But first we have to drill a hole. Now you can get a Schrader valve at any tire store. Just walk in and say, hey, you got an extra valve laying around? They'll probably give you one. Okay, I'm gonna work out the hole a little bit more. It was a little bit too small. But once I've got it filled, there we go, we're all set. We've got the valve in there. Now all we need to do is attach this end cap to the other piece of PVC pipe. That's gonna be our air chamber. So I'll start by coating it up again with the rubber cement. And then I will place the valve on. And again, 30 seconds in place. Once you've got it set, add the other end to the valve as well, using the same process. Get the coat of glue around it. Now I'll place it back into the valve. All right, now I'm gonna let this dry for about two to three hours. That's all it takes. So we've got our full pneumatic cannon. Let's give it a shot. So here's where the magic happens. We're adding a bunch of air pressure to one end of our chamber here. And now that valve, when we release it, is gonna release 70 PSI out into the wild, and it's gonna shoot out whatever we put into the other end of the tube. So let's load it up. Now to load this bad boy, all we gotta do is stick the spud in there, Push it down, and it's ready for action. Far this one yet. Wow. Now before we get to the fails and other bonus footage, I want to thank this week's sponsor, Audible. Audible.com is the leading provider of downloadable digital audiobooks and spoken word entertainment. Audible has over 75,000 titles to choose from, and you can put them directly on your MP3 player or iPod. You can play them back anytime, anywhere. You know, you can choose from all kinds of stuff too. Science fiction, thrillers, drama, comedy, you name it. Now, if you head over to audiblepodcast.com slash Tuesdays, you can get a free audiobook to try out for yourself. Now, again, that's audiblepodcast.com slash Tuesdays. So next time you're on that road trip or you got a flight to catch... Just put on an audiobook and zonk out. Enjoy the ride. This will be a mortar shot. One shot over the lake, up high. Oh. 
Wow. Wow.